mile. $400. The one is Rockwell and Rumble. About Myron Brown and David, David Brahman of Arcanum, Ohio. Myron Brown trains Dave Brumbaugh drives. The two Tudors Express, owned by Robert Reynolds of London. Leo Groves, the trainer Terry Groves, driving. Three is Street Rags, owned by Kevin Manley of Beaver Creek and Newton of Clarksville. Kevin Manley trains Tim Newton, driving. Number four, Windland, owned by Terry Hall of Franklin. He also trains Dave Miller Drives. The five, Native Prospect. Hobo Wade Chafin, Jr., Wasterville, Robert Chafin, the uh, trainer and uh, driver. From post six, Manhattan uh, Breeze, owned by Karen Wiegand and Buddy Conley. Brian Weaver, the trainer, Jim Daly. Uh. And the seven, Malabar Star, owned by uh, Benny Holler of Chillicothe, Art Jones of Frankfurt, Dan Eater, the trainer and the driver. One play show perfecta, trifecta, and daily double wagering. No changes in the second race. Sec First race, pacing, stallions, and gildings. Lining up, men, moving in. On the back stretch, approaching the start. And uh, they're off. And from the far outside, Malabar Star times at the gate perfectly and quickly takes the lead. Manhattan Breeze from post six came away second. Rock Roland Rumble from off the pylons is third. It's a gap of three lengths. Fourth, the two dudes express inside to five. Winland followed sixth by Street Frags around the first turn. Inside and seventh, Native Prospect. Pacers are in straight alignment here as they reach the first quarter mile marker opening panel in 29 seconds. And Malabar Star has a lead here. Leads by two. Manhattan Breeze. A 13 to 1 shot right at his heels. The garden spot trip for him. Rock Roland Rumble sits content third. It's still a gap of three to Tudor's Express, followed by Winland, who waits patiently. And Street Rags now comes to the outside, and uh, Street Rags getting the first look here will flush cover in front of him. And uh, Native Prospect continues to trail some seven lengths off the front end. They are approaching the half now, and Malabar Star has a lead here, the half in 101. And uh, one fifth. Now to the back stretch, and Malabar Star by a length and a half, two, and Manhattan Breeze is still there, biding his time second. And moving up on the outside, here comes Winland now. Winland getting underway is first up third in the pocket, fourth, Rock Roland Rumble, gapping cover the outside five, Street Rags at the rail and sixth as they race on towards the uh, three quarter mile marker, Tudor's Express. Into the final turn, and it's Malabar Star, and he's led every stop of the mile. The three quarters, 131 and 2. Malabar Star still by a length, but on the outside, Winland now. They're at the leader's wheel, is applying the pressure. Manhattan Breeze, yet to be used, should be well rested for the stretch drive. And Rock Roll and Rumble comes into position now. They move to the top of the stretch. They've lost an eighth of a mile ago, and it's Malabar Star with a lead. Manhattan Breeze down to the inside, but Malabar Star is digging in gamely here. He'll fight off. Off the challenger, it's Malabar Star at the wire. Manhattan Breeze was second over Winland. Time of the mile, two minutes and two fifths. Seven Malabar Star. This a three-year-old son of the Ohio standing Tudor Scooter from his first crop. For the steady special mare, a special song. He's owned by Benny Holler of Chillicothe and Art Jones of Frankfurt. Trained and nicely handled by Dan Ader. Mellow Bear Star making his first, of, first start of the season and recording his first career win. Pacing the mile in record time, two minutes and two thirds. First race perfect to 7 6, $33.60. 33 the trifecta 7 6, 4, $53.60.